Let's talk about this conversation between Seema and Carrie in episode eight, season two of And Just Like That. Because there's a lot of women I know, personally like me, who can relate to the issues that Seema had with Carrie. And now for some context, remember that uh, Seema and Carrie had rented uh, a house in the Hamptons and they were going to have like hot girl single fun in the Hamptons. But that's not happening because Carrie completely forgot about it because of a man, Aiden. Now, no hate to Aiden because I actually like him. Um, but this is what Carrie does. Like a man comes into her life and then everything else that she has with her girlfriends just goes to the wayside. And, and I'm thinking, are, are we still doing this in our 50s? A man comes in and just everything else that we had planned with our girlfriends just gets shot because man. And then here's Carrie trying to like justify like, oh, but you're going to love Aiden, you know, and he's only going to be there like for a week and whatever, you know. And Seema is like, she's being nice, but really it's like, bitch, please. Okay, we, we, we're... <laughs> I, we're not going to have fun. What I had in mind was like hot girl, single, fun, fabulous. We got money. We can, you know, do what we want. That's the kind of summer I wanted to have. Like, I, I don't want boyfriend coming in, hanging out. And then you're like, oh, you know, I'm in love, blah, blah, blah. When I want to like, you know, go out, hit the town, pick up on guys or flirt, fun, go to parties. As two fun single gals. And me as a viewer, I was looking forward to that. Because I'm like, that sounds cool. I want to see two fabulous women with money in their 50s having the time of their lives. Like, I wanted to see that content. But the writers are just like, they're insistent in like getting, getting these women coupled up in relationships instead of like, can, can we see what their life is like fabulous on their own, exploring their own issues without trying to like be with somebody? Like just put dating on hiatus and just go have some fun. Go have some adventures. Go try new things. Something that doesn't involve being in a relationship. Because I'm like, seriously, are we still doing this in our 50s? Like, I don't want to watch this again. Like, I went through my 20s and 30s of watching girlfriends and friends completely toss aside everything because some dude comes in and then it's like, oh, okay, like the single girl fun is like gone. And then you're, you're friends with the, the, the new guy or trying to justify like, oh, no, things are not going to, you know, they're not going to be different. We can still go out and have fun and do the thing. Uh, again, no, bitch. That's not how it works. And you know that. You know that's true. So I totally understand why Seema was avoiding her and trying to sneak out of the salon without talking to her. But, you know, kudos kudos to her uh, and Carrie for having this conversation because that, that's actually healthy. But, I, you know, and, and Seema was, in my opinion, being very polite about the whole thing because personally, if, if I were her... I would be really mad because, again, we had booked this house in the Hamptons for a hot summer and I was excited about that. And girl, you blew me off again for, for a dude. Like That would make me really mad. But again, kudos to them for at least having the conversation and then, you know, think, things worked out in the end. But man, I... And just like that, could we could we just have a moment where we see these women exploring their own lives and selves separate from being in a relationship? Because honestly, that's the content that would get me excited and I want to see. Because I'm the same age as all of them. And also, it would be something aspirational, right? Outside of like being in a relationship. Because there's more to life. And we know this in our 50s. There is way more to life than just, you know, being with a guy. And again, no no shade to being in love. I mean, that's fabulous. I would like that too. Um, 
But, you know, for once, can, can we just see women in their 50s enjoying their lives as them without being coupled up? That would be awesome. 